You know, I didn't realize at that point in time it was going to be my last game. But I do remember this. I remember that during that game, it was a close game. and We were struggling, but things that worked out well for us. But I, what I do remember is two things. One, as I remember, and I didn't hear this years after, that our players got together and they said together, we don't want to be the only team that Coach K has a losing season. And I'll tell you, like I said, I didn't hear that a number of years later. But I look back and I, that really meant a lot to me, what the players put forth and what their interests were, and et cetera. And I think the other thing that really stands out is my decision that this was the last game that I would coach. And this is what happened. I went down after the season started recruiting. I went down to a high school down by Hutchison, Kansas, and I talked to one of my former players who happened to be a teacher there. And I said, Mike, how are you doing? I went to his classroom, knocked on the door, of course, and he came out. And I said, Mike, how are you doing? And I'll never forget what he said. He said, Coach, I'm really hurting. And he said that with emotion. And I went back home and I read a book called Purpose Driven Life. And at that point, I thought, hey, that's a sign. And that was a part of the decision that, well, that's a part of the reason I made a decision to step away from the coaching aspect. Hug your loved ones. Take the Lord with you.